everybody, it's Ms. Henderson. And as I told you previously about all the stuff going on in March, I mentioned that it's Women's History Month. So I, um, in another video, I had gave you pretty much a lot of the women's biographies that we have. So probably anybody that you want, we have the biography. So I just got some general books here that have a little bit of everybody in them. These um, books, she persisted. I really like these because they just give a little, just a little paragraph of anybody you want to know about. This is written by Chelsea Clinton, both of these books. And this book, although it looks like it would be for uh, little kids, this one actually goes into a little bit more detail. This is called Little Leaders, Bold Women in Black History. So it's got some of everybody in here. Ella Fitzgerald, Josephine Baker, Alice Ball, Zora Neale Hurston. And then this is 100 Women Who Made History. This has some of everybody in it too. And this one, she persisted. This, these are people, worldwide women who've made a difference in the world. Wow, this one kind of focuses on American women. And I just wanted to read one little snippet from here to let you know what this book has in it. And the first one in here is about Harriet Tubman. And it says, Harriet Tubman was born a slave and her story could have ended there. Instead, she persisted escaping from slavery and becoming the most famous conductor on the Underground Railroad. She risked her life many times to lead countless slaves to freedom, including her family, friends, and strangers. Every person she led to freedom arrived safely. I should fight for my liberty as long as my strength lasted. Well, I just have little snippets. That's what I like about it. Well, so kids can just learn a little bit, get to know these names. And we've got, like I said, we've got plenty of other biographies and other books about women, so come and celebrate Women's History Month with us all this month. I also have coloring sheets that I'm going to have upstairs. Um, I'm not going to have them out because we don't want a lot of people touching them, but you can ask somebody in the children's department or ask the person at the circulation desk to look in the children's mailbox, and that's where they'll be. Thank you.